this come to V8, boy. Yes, sir. A little trip to Essex. Twice in one week actually. Yeah. Three times in one week. It's pretty jokes to be fair, it's all rattling around. Um yeah, cool. right, rather talking than here, let's get out of the motor. Yeah, yeah, got V8. You said you didn't want a V8 and uh I've ended up with a V8. Yep. Yeah. No, I mean they weigh the same. They weigh basically the same. There's five pounds difference in those two. Which things. is crazy, and that's just the difference between cast iron and aluminium. Yeah. So that V8 is all aluminium. And that's uh, yeah, Rover V8 in it. 3.5 litre Rover V8. And we just ripped the top off now quickly to have a look at it. And that looks clean as you like. Clean as a whistle, boy. Well. Compared to this old beauty, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it doesn't really bother me. Well, that's it. This that's the whole video on this now, isn't it? Yeah, right. Rebuilding Next the time. Rover V8. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, it fits on the chassis. Hopefully, it fits in underneath the shell. With a bit of butchering. Also, noticeably as well, it's got two carburetors rather than yeah, the one that was on top of this. Which, I mean, I don't know anything about carburetors. I'm gonna have to balance them equally the same and the tune everything. So now there's two headaches instead of one headache. But there is four. Exhaust ports for the four cylinders on each bank. Yeah, just just to reiterate, I don't know if we this mentioned a, that. This has got three cylinders, one, two, three, but there's two exhaust ports coming out, so all the heat and the gases are fused into two from three holes, which is not good. This, you've got one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, so they all go their own individual. They can all have a little exhaust party themselves. Cool. All right, well. Now I've got to find a gearbox uh, and take all the parts. So, I guess that's the next step, isn't it? Imagine it being like 20 foot long. <laughs> <laughs> Just doing that. Cool, man. Is this stock? Yeah. Dunno, there's no, there's literally, there's no burrs or mo it barely looks like it's been in there for very long at all. This is the one off a of 36. I've made it to an ornament. <laughs> Go hide the, the toilet. This is just a profile. roll of stuff. <laughs> yeah, the profile's well high on it, isn't it? Yeah. Are you pretty pleased then with your purchase? Yeah, I still don't know what this, this is. Is it? I don't even know what a cam looks like in terms of like performance. Yeah. It had a rubber head gasket on it. 
which means this probably is rover also. Yeah. All right. What source can we find? That's the question. Yes, so so yeah. What the plan is potentially to. I need to just have it sound in like. Yeah, modify it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, race cams on it. All right, cool. So some modifying, some paint, some new gaskets and seals and stuff. There's one more thing we need to do before you can go and have a poo. <laughs> Why are you sticking <laughs> on me like that? I don't to, need a poo, guys. We need to take the stump off. Yeah, that's true. Big splosh! Let the juices flow. <laughs> yep, yeah, stock. No, she got... Like you're saying, bro, is we've never seen this thing run. Yeah. So I don't know if I leave the crank as it is and then I put all the engine back together and put it in there, then like bearings might be rattly as hell or something. Mm. Do you know what I mean? And I might never know about it until we try and start it. Which is why I'm inclined to go to full shebang, because we've already been here and done this before. Yeah, that's true. Yeah? Well, I think I've seen enough for now. Yeah, that's enough. You don't deserve it. No. <laughs> <laughs> you don't deserve it. Alright, well, hopefully we'll be doing some stuff to it. I've, I've said stuff because neither of us know what's going to happen. But it needs some paint. Ha 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 ha!